Welcome to another Tech Tuesday at Fitech. Today I'm going to cover a problem I've seen a few times, it's pretty rare, you may have come across it, but most of you haven't. It's when the ignition switch is actually at fault. It'll show up as a hard start or a no start, or maybe even just a, a dead spot in the middle of the switch. It's really easy to diagnose after you know that it's actually a possible problem. Some of the symptoms of a bad ignition switch could be difficult starting or sudden stalling with no explanation other than the ignition switch. The way to diagnose the ignition switch is to just watch on the handheld, watch the RPM. If during cranking it has RPM and then as you lift off, the RPM suddenly goes to zero and comes back, that's indicating a bad ignition switch. That means the voltage for the ignition to our key on switch is going to zero suddenly and coming back. I've had that problem where the dead spot is right between on and start. I've seen it on Mopars, I've seen it on C10. I'm going to show you in this video how it occurred to us in this C10. A, it was difficult to start. And B, if you just touch the switch, the thing would shut off. Watch this key switch. It's running right now. There's a dead spot. It turns off between start and on. That's a surefire way to have really difficult starting, so this ignition switch has to get replaced. Another time that I saw this problem, it was on a car that was just idling, 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 and it would just shut off randomly, or if like even in an intersection, which is really dangerous. It took us a while to figure out it was actually just the ignition switch after the customer told us, of course, that he had just replaced the ignition switch. So we had a good time trying to replace everything else except for that, but we eventually figured it out. It was actually just the ignition switch. So it can be a little difficult to figure out these random stalling issues, but I'm sure with a little bit of insight as to that it is a possibility, you'll be able to solve your problem if you have it. The simplest remedy for an ignition switch problem is to actually replace the ignition switch. Um, a bypass can be done temporarily to help diagnose whether it's the ignition switch or not. So if you're experiencing any of the symptoms of random stalling, starts and dies as you try to turn the key back, or maybe if you wiggle the key a little bit and it dies, it's a problem with your ignition switch. So before you send back the system for any kind of tech support, make sure you've isolated that the ignition switch is good or bad. Thanks for watching another Tech Tuesday at FiTech. Hit the like and subscribe. If you have any questions, you can call our tech support or email us. Join us again for another Tech Tuesday at FiTech next week.